it's Jeremy from WebsiteBuilderExpert.com and in this Weebly tutorial we're going to show you how to change the design of the fonts uh, on your website. So some questions, some of you may ask how do I change the color or the styling of the font here in the paragraph title or just the text in the paragraphs. Weebly makes it super simple if you, so you can configure this and once you make the change uh, the change will apply across the entire website come to the design tab here click on design options and site title this refers to the site title here and you can change the font to whatever you want there's a selection of fonts right here so I'm just gonna pick uh, luckiest guy right away it changes the font style just for this site title and you notice everything else um, the font styles everywhere else uh, remain the same I can click a different color and I can also change the size. So if you thought, well, I don't really like it, but I can't find the original styling of the site title, what you need to do is just click reset default and it's gonna go right back to the original. Same thing for paragraph title. This refers to the title element, which is this one right here. Okay, so just come back here to the paragraph title. Same idea, you can choose whatever font you want. I want to pick um, this one here. I want to just make it a little bit different. And I'm going to pick a different color uh, and make it a lot bigger, like so. For paragraph text, I'm going to pick this one here and change the color to, let's say, green. Um, and make it slightly bigger. It's a little bit too big. So, but you get the point. It's very easy. The changes are applied across the entire website uh, right away. Last one here is length. So I have a, a phrase here that I hyperlink to weebly.com, for example, um, and uh, you can configure the link color right here. So you can change the link color if someone visited uh, or clicked through the, the link already, uh, it will show a different color to remind the visitor that, that the destination web page has already been visited. And for hover is when your visitor hovers the mouse cursor over the link, it, the color will change, uh, indicating um, to the visitor that this is a link that you can click on. So that's how you configure the fonts and style them on your website.